Hey, it's Carter Hutton here, NHL goalie, and coming up on the episode of I Only Touch Greatness. 2014, signed to Nashville, one-year deal. Uh, at the end of that opening season, he signed a two-year deal. How did it feel to be recognized enough to get a two-year deal as opposed to one? It was good. It was honestly something I had been, uh, you know, in a dogfight. Like when, when Chicago, during the playoffs that year, they signed Auntie Ranta. And uh, the writing was kind of on the wall for me. It was like, I'm not the guy here anymore. Um, and there was always kind of this riff, like where the Bowmans really loved me, Stan and Scotty. And, and Quenville was a bigger fan of bigger goalies, I guess, um, which I was kind of told or whatever the way it was. And during that cup run, the, Nashville was like, we want you here. Um, you know, we love you. And I had to, had a ton of success against their American league team. I think I was like 11 and two over two years against Milwaukee and they loved me. So they brought me in and, and it was to be Pekka's, you know, they wanted a guy they could get for a discounted rate. And, um, they actually, they flew me in on a visit. It was probably my first ever recruiting trip flew me into, and then I come in and they have like Carter Hutton, like my Jersey yeah. on the jumbotron. I come in, they have everything laid out for me. And I, I went into a meeting and, uh, I only had played one game at that point and I had played against St. Louis with the Hawks and I lost three, one. Um, and they were playing for home ice. They dressed a bunch of Rockford players. So I'm in a meeting with Poyle and Trotz and, and the goalie coach, Mitch Korn. And they're like, David Poyle's like, you know, you've only played one game. You don't have a lot of experience, but you won that one game. And that's important having a win under your belt. Meanwhile, I'm sitting there like, I know I lost the game. So I'm like, what, do I correct? <laughs> do I correct them? What do I say here? And I'm like, yep, no, that's right, David. You know, we got one win and you know, I want to get more to go. So I ended up, uh, taking that and then and then when i signed that deal i i remember i almost having like imposter syndrome when my agent sent it to me like this is the deal and i'm like let's get this thing signed before they uh realize they sent it to the wrong guy <laughs> uh what's your favorite sports movie oh favorite sports movie like i well i grew up on slap shot so that's definitely like my favorite hockey movie uh by far um and i think if i had to say other favorite sports movie right now gun to my head uh major league i'm a big major league okay. fan i think that movie is is unbelievable uh 2016 <laughs> signed signed with the blues what made you choose st louis when you had anywhere you could have gone um you know the, i left nashville uc saros was coming um, they would Nashville wanted to assign me, um, to a one year deal. I wanted two years. It was just kind of the term right at that point I had played well enough. Um, so I decided to leave, go to free agency. They, they kind of, one of the assistant GMs kind of motherfucked me out the door, like just saying I'm an idiot for leaving and my agent. And, um, you know, I, I just got to a point where it was the right choice for me. I knew with Pekka there, I was never really going to get anywhere, um, you know, to grow my game and, and that's nothing against Pekka. He's, that's why he's one of the best in the world. And I wasn't sure where I was going to go. We had a bunch of options. And the night of the draft, um, Doug Armstrong came to my agent and just said, we're going to trade Brian Elliott away. Uh, I think that's when he ended up in with Calgary. And uh, we want to sign Carter. And that was kind of the no-brainer pick to me because it, it just felt like the perfect scenario where Jake Allen had never been the starter. He was still pretty young. Um, and the team was good. So I'd have a chance to play on a good team and, and really kind of get more minutes and hopefully play well. And it, it, it worked out really well for me.